Zerango kote ne kote ne te sweba ona saruza esa ishe jamon o asikara kara ema ona zito zito nga ze moko ona zaka zaka
baba wakati Musa alikamruka nasi kuleta bachende usiona kujijua yesu pia kwa Yesu Kristo asiwetera no kutenda ile swala nasi na matutendera kwa baba penyu niliba tano nekuta kwenye asha zenyu baba tina kugobata ne zara tino kutenda i Jehova mwalima karurama unotirwira jesu Yesu Kristo kuva kuko baehenyika ino nokutenda i pamsoro pezo makati kwa shoko rinotirwira baba rinotisimudzira baba taungana kuungandira shoko irori jesu Yesu Kristo makati kwa menzaniso baba we mutambo wa Abraham Isaac heavenly father baba Abraham atitwagira mukazi Isaac atenzi Yesu Kristo baba akandoana atenzi Yesu Kristo Rebecca baba mangamera akapa Rebecca mvura ngo mangamera akamtakura kuenda kudume wake Isaac baba marizo yatakatambira atenzi Yesu Kristo kuenda kupedzimira ndo marizo yatitakura baba musangana ndevi mumakore kutenda kuti taungandira baba zviripo taungandira baba tenzi Jesu Kristo tokorenyu tagadzira mwedu baba tawaridza kuti mimi mutaure nedzu Jehova mwari makarurama ndo zvataungana baba tipei chikafu baba chimba tenzi Jesu Kristo tinoburuka kudenga ndiro shoko rataungandira zodzai mimbisi wenzio Jehova mwari makarurama mapedza kudaro patinokumbirawo muzodze baba mufarizo we shoko tinzwe kabva kubva kwamburi nekuti kanzwa kubva kuwanhu ishe asina zvatinoti zvichibatsira asiti kanzwa baba kubva kwamburi ishe tinobuda tine chimwe chatakabata tinokutenda ai baba taungandira ivi taura ine zwishe baba hamuna kumbira pasina makapira zviripo makafa baba kuti ndive neukama ndemi wakati tsanga egorosi baba ikaenda pasi ikasaora haikoni kudukira makaenda pasi pamudzi wemoyo tenzi Jesu Kristo wenyika kukambuka kuakafa Jehova makambuka ne hupenyu ndo hupenyu watakaunganira pano hupenyu we shoko baba tiumbei tipanana nemi titsure i Jehova matina kutsurwa titambidze zvota kutambidzwa Jehova nekuti makati munoziva zvose isupachenishe takambomirira kutungamirwa nemi Baba tinokutenda ai baba nemarizo tinoti tungamira baba kuna baba vedu mazvita henyu mana kuna kutenda ai tanga ine zu Jehova kumbopedza ne zuama tenzi Jesu Kristo tinokutenda ai pazose tinokutenda ai kuna zose ishe wende ikagamureke kubuda munhu baba apinda achirwara obuda achirwara apinda ari kutadzi obuda ari kutadzi apigoneki nokuti pose padaidzwa pamusangano wa William Branham Profesor wa pakati kumbira vanhu vaipinda vaine ma situation vaibuda vasina ndo zvatakatarikira pano nekuti shoko renyu baba parinoburuka rinokonzeresa kuti vanhu vashanduke tinokutenda ai baba tichiisa zvose mumaoko menyu tisinga ratisi kuti mumaoko mavere amen
Hashem and the Jewish people will be at tremendous Thank you. 
of the things I can't do them. But where I manage also take advantage. Take advantage, write notes, take advantage of that. Maybe that's the area I'm strong in the message. So I have to do this because very soon we'll be talking about So if I don't say what I'm saying, the build up will come that uh, it will be very difficult for you. Because campets are abused. Esther is abused. Adasa is Babylonian. Do you follow what you are saying? So, seasons and times. Now it's evening time. The stars are shining. 
Gracious Lord, we come before your throne of mercy so that we to stand before believers. So that we to stand before your people. So that we to stand before those who are in your program, in your plan. You have, witty, uh, you have whispered to these people. They know your direction. They know what you want. They are just triggering the seed that is in them. Just like that little boy who was going over the 12 steps. And ultimately, he recognized himself. Father God, may these ones also see themselves in the Bible. May they cry out like that little boy. Mama, that's me. May they see their position as well. Especially after 1955. By going away of the prophet. After many seeds have gone on before. It's all us who remain. Amidst a lot of confusion. Lots of false teaching. Lots of false love. May you humble them. May this church recognize themselves. May they also cry out. Mama, that's me. Their positions in the Bible. As you have seen them before the foundation of the world. We pray tonight in the name of the Lord Jesus. And we take over every spirit. And put it under our feet. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Let's take our seats. My sisters, you need to understand quite a lot what I'm going to be talking about here. I'm putting things in for me to bring out a point. You are people I'm so happy over. The way you run your homes. The way you really are running your families. Where you have a problem, I will advise you. So tonight it's not anything just to say anything against you. But there is a big woman who is so much contrary to the Bible. Which is the Catholic system. And what this message has done, it has managed to isolate the devil and really put him there to expose him, to, to expose him the way he does his things. Praise the Lord. And also you brothers, uh, you know how much I trust you, you know how much I love you. If there is a problem, we are advising you. But allow us to just talk in the Bible this evening. Praise the Lord. God is so wonderful. So, my main aim tonight, and in this subject, is we learn to apply the things that we learn to today's eh, condition. Praise the Lord. If we talk about Esther, then it just remains a situation of 521 BC. Then we are not really helping the cause. 521 BC is too far away from where we are today. So, uh, you know, uh, who, who must be held? That situation of 521 BC must be transposed into today. 
Esther was a shining star. Then we must be having the shining stars also today. But if it remains a yesterday's story, then believing is not even necessary. Preaching is not even necessary. Because what is the purpose? In you, God has deposited a seed. As we continue to describe it, and we are looking at your father's album, seeing the divine pictures of yourself and your family, you begin to know. I belong. These are my people. And these are my promises. So, the reason why we take it like that, we are just describing you, we are talking about you. Because in Job, it says, where were you? Are we together? So, uh, that's my approach tonight. So, we are looking at this great woman. You look at her. At a time, she is not recognized where she must be standing. Then she recognizes. Then she serves the people of Israel. Because of a marriage. And look at the way she lives with her uncle. Mordecai. Mordecai. Everything is in the picture of God. So let's look at that woman now. How she comes into view. So this is what we want to talk about. So I'm looking from verse 1. I'll be very quick. For you to understand what I want to say. <laughs> now it came to pass in the days of Ahasuerus, uh, there were many days. Do you follow what I'm saying? Just like the days of Elijah. But in the days of the voice. It's not in one day. It's many, many days. Since he started. 1946. We are still in the days. Are we together there? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So this Ahasuerus. He was a leader in a very large province from India even unto Ethiopia. I told you Ethiopia means Africa. So in some parts of Africa here uh, they were leading because we hear of a Persian rule. Persian is just in the Gulf. But from the Gulf, you come into Egypt. When you say Egypt, you are already in Africa. Ethiopia as a land. With Addis Ababa as the capital. So Ethiopia was meaning people of a black skin. Reason why we have also with the people we call the Ethiopian Jews. Yeah, the Ethiopian Jews. Why? Because uh, Queen Candace, uh, uh, she, uh, she, she was coming from uh, the lower parts of the land, going into Israel crossing the deserts and uh, she got into Solomon's kingdom. So, but this one now also was sweeping into Africa from India. India is such a vast nation. Remember, it is the largest 
population. Is it not the biggest? Second after China. Praise the Lord. So uh, they have a lot of people. And they are quite an advanced people as well. But in those days, verse 2, if you could be flying what I'm reading here, <coughs> when the king Ahasuerus, Mambo Ahasuerus sat on the throne of his kingdom, which was in Shushan. Shushan was in Babylon. Shushan in Babylon. This is the same where Nehemiah was. This is the same where Daniel was. This is the same where Esther was. This is the same where Ezra was. This is the same where Ezekiel was. Quite a number of those Jews, eh? When they were taken under Rehoboam, do you want to think so? When Nebuchadnezzar took them there, I was telling you, they were not made doers of water and carrier uh, of wood and carriers of water. They were then allowed to develop. Reason why we have prominence in the in what we call the river Euphrates. Yes, though there is a physical river called Euphrates. But the Bible means more than that. It became a center of trade for Babylon. Remember, I was telling you the rivers have got banks. Yeah, the rivers have got banks. What happens on the banks? A lot of siltation on the banks. It becomes the most prominent part of the river. And people want to settle on the river banks. Because those are fertile places. So in this case, there was a lot of trading. Water trading. Land trading. Uh, quite a number of things. It was happening all there. And in that period of Babylon, what began to what began to happen? Developments and developments. But that's not my subject. We'll see it when we take Revelation 18. But this Babylon in type is the same Babylon that we talk of now. In Revelation 18. Praise the Lord. So we are building and building and building and once we zero up uh, then, 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 then we break. Uh, uh, praise the Lord. Amen. We break into the things that we want. Praise the Lord. Amen. So in the third year, verse 3, of his reign, he made a feast. Israel was conspicuous with feasts. I think you remember the seven feasts Israel had. These ones also, on the Babylonian side, they had also feasts unto all his princes. So it means these people had a government. They had a hierarchy. They had a system. All his princes and his servants. The power the power of Persia and Media. 
Now you see where we are now. That central part now. Which means the oil that we have in Iraq. The oil that we have in Iran. The oil that we have in Saudi Arabia. The oil that we have in those other parts. This king was exposed to that. The use of the Suez Canal which really becomes uh, which really becomes the gateway to America uh, was exposed to this man so he was rich on the sea he was rich in the air he was rich on the land. So you see, he's got black gold here. He's got natural gold. Because if it is Africa, then he was coming into DRC. DRC is one of the richest in the world. In terms of natural reserves. Reason why there is turmoil every time. It's for them to have confusion. So that their things can be taken at a very Giveaway price. Don't agree with the person who comes to throw confusion on you. There is something that he wants to tap out from you for free. Yeah, divided we fall. And united we stand. And this is how our continent has been exploited. And yeah, we, we, we are made to be enemies against one another. And we think you are getting a benefit when they are actually taking more. Let me not be more political there. Uh, uh, but God bless you, I'm speaking the truth even still. So this was in media and Persia. The nobles and the princes of the provinces being before him. So he was quite an important figure. These princes from all these provinces. They are coming for this feast. Because the king has invited. So look at what he's doing. He's explaining on his economy here. When he showed the riches of his glorious kingdom. Which means he had unsearchable riches. God is having examples in kings. God is having examples in the heavenly body. God is also telling us a story here. The way he's running his kingdom is actually personified in this kind of a kingdom. So he is unsearchable riches. God also is so rich. He has unsearchable riches. So this book, if they were throwing it in the river Elbi, it was just lack of revelation. If they were saying we don't see the name God in it, it was just lack of revelation. If they were saying we don't see the name Jehovah in it, except only a fast that was called for by had, uh, Esther. Uh, fast. Uh, fasting. 
That's the only thing that they thought was scriptural in life. Every other thing, they were thinking it was an elevation of a Persian king. It was breaking history of a Persian king. But that's not it. It was not description of that. God is actually bringing us to something. And remember, he's using a character called Esther. Esther, Genesis 1. Esther, Genesis 1. Creation. He makes the stars. When you see the stars, they work in relationship with the sun, with the, uh, with the stars. They work in relationship with the sun. So when the sun is absent, then the stars are also shining. Are we together? But this Esther we say, it, it means a, a shining star, a supernova. And we saw Orion, a shining star, there in the heavenly body. And it's seen world over. Praise the Lord. When it breaks open, then it's seen world over with its seven group of stars. Listen to these things, brothers. Orion in the sky, seven groups of stars. And this Ahasuerus, seven princes, seven chamberlains, seven, 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 seven. What is it that God wants us to learn? Out of this, and this woman, <coughs> when we say Esther, then that's Jewish. <coughs> when we say Hadassah, then that's Babylonian. Babylon. So to us, she is relevant as well. Reason why we are looking at this kingdom because the seven stars, or the seven princes, they are then talking of the seven church ages. And we happen to be in the seven church ages. We happen to be closing them now. So that another portion can then open of the Jews. So Esther, Esther, speaking of the season of the Jews, and you see what is happening now. What is happening out there? Ukraine. Ukraine. What is happening? A lot of wars. Billions being pumped in. What does the Ukraine war stand for? A preparatory ground. For the war of Armageddon. They are seeing their strengths. And as they prepare to come into this war. Because you have already groups and blocks that are already standing. Now you got a NATO group. Then you got this other group that is China, eh, the Eastern Bloc. Mm-hmm. And the way India is talking now, it's just showing that that country is an eastern country. Praise the Lord. Because their language now, let Europe never involve everybody when they get into a war. Let they th- let them not think when they get into a problem, it's everyone's problem. You see? Because they were thinking the world would isolate India. And he says this man, 
do they recognize that I'm one third of the world's population? I'm one of the oldest civilizations. We are also a very strong economy. He says we are number six in the world economy. Praise the Lord. Those things, they interest me when I look at them. Praise the Lord. So this man had unsearchable riches. So he was showing his princes his glorious kingdom and the honor of his excellent majesty many days. Just describing about the kingdom. Just describing about his riches. It took him 180 days. Do you remember the Bible says, it is the Lord who gives the power for one to get rich. Uh, do you know it's God who gives you that? Yes. The Lord gives you that. The Lord makes you rich. Go and read Deuteronomy 8, 18. Deuteronomy 18. Praise the Lord. So this man was enabled by God to be a rich person. So Maybe the Lord wants you to be rich as well. Oh, but you know, it could be just your attitude. That when you get your money, you want to eat it alone. You will not share with us. The reason why you are poor. Certain things are just blocked. But when you open up, you can see this Deuteronomy 18, 8, 18 happening to you well. Let's go on to verse 5. And when these days were fulfilled, the king made a feast unto all the people who were present in Shushan. Eh? Shushan was the palace. Both unto great and small. Seven days. Hey. A gala for seven days. Drinking and eating. This kingdom was very rich. But I'm also interested in this language already. There is also the mighty God in heaven who makes a feast for us, the Gentile people. In seven days, seven days, seven years, are we together? And he makes a feast right from Ephesus going up and up until we come to Laodicea where we are. Our God, our King is making a feast for us. Do you follow what he is saying? Brothers? He is making a feast for his people. We also have a feast in our day. Yeah? So, it's God explaining something. Remember, Christ is the mystery of God revealed. And Brother Branham says, God had a threefold purpose. Number one, to reveal himself before his people. So, from Genesis to today, he has been working to do that. But when he has revealed himself in his people, what does he want? He wants to get into them and have the preeminence. Rulership. Are we together? God has been aiming to dwell in people. God has been aiming to speak through people. 
Reason why when he did it in William Branham, he was so happy when the book came. He says, and something said. Who, who is that something? It's the God in him now. Are we together? Praise the Lord. When the hornets flew up, and something said, when the maniac of Oregon was coming, and something said, when you also go into situations, there must be more of God in you. But there will be something that says, God wants to dwell in his people. That's the preeminence. But when he has dwelt in those people, he wants to take them back to the Garden of Eden. To Adam and Eve again. When we say Adam and Eve, you see the perfect example of a man. You see God's real intentions. Through these people, God did not want people to die. Neither did he want uh, the woman to be worried of a pregnancy. Adam was just supposed to just speak. And it would not worry the woman. She would be pregnant, expecting. When time to give birth comes, she would just deliver. Multiply and replenish. But because we have gone into the negative now, another civilization took us up. And that negative civilization is what we want to remove. Are we together? Yeah, right from the day she catches pregnancy, she begins to be sick. Until the end of nine months. Until people said you were delivered. It means that you were in a fix. Praise the Lord. She delivered. It took a certain power for her to be delivered. The issue was not rosy. Now let's leave that and continue on with this that we want to say. In church brethren, praise the Lord. We are building on this. And I want you to, when, when, when you read scripture, it must just speak for itself. Don't leave the book and say, yeah. this one, I don't understand it. Ah, ah. No. We want you to really say it to your family Having certain notes in the Bible. When there's an no, article, the the it will be saying, where do you get this? In the end time message. In the end time message. So that's so, brethren. Praise the Lord. And when, the, and when these days were fulfilled, the king made a feast unto all the people who were present in Shushan. Of course, Shushan is the palace. Both unto great and small. Seven days in the court of the garden of the king's palace. Praise the Lord. Mm. Where were white, green, blue hangings fastened with cords and fine linen and purple to silver rings and pillars of marble? Uh, blue. You women, you want beautiful things. Look in the Bible. Those things are there. Praise the Lord. Amen. So they pick up uh, the, 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 the developers, they pick up this idea and go and do more. They go and do more. They and do The couches were of gold and silver. Upon a pavement of red. Then 
Do you see those red carpets? They don't start today. Praise the Lord. Amen. They were there. Akangariko. And blue. blue. And now you understand the way the American presidents dress. Trump. Trump. At times you see him in a red tie. Speaking of authority. Praise the Lord. Amen. I'm the most powerful one. Eh? Then blue. blue. Speaking of royalty. Eh? Going on like that. Eh? Black. Uh, black. Speaking of me. <laughs> I'm tickled black. Amen. Uh, I mean. I mean. black. Uh, if I am in the black skin. White and black marble. Uh, Listen to this. And they gave, they gave them drink in vessels of gold. Being diverse of one another. Sister, I you must not give us water, you know. A disfigured cup. Look and see what the others are doing. Praise the Lord. Amen, my sister. Amen, sisters. Those ones that are now disfigured, you must just leave them. You know? My way, my way, my way. Uh, upon uh, when 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 a wife sees, when they say let's see uh, her pots and stuff, you wonder yeah. these pots or what? Go and buy something. That's you better. Uh, if there's nothing, there's nothing then. Junkyard. Apapa angari of vessels of gold. Apapa kanga pa ni mizio endarama. Eh? This is where they were drinking from. Di mo malai nungwa kuvama muri. And you know God has a variety of vessels. Uno ziamngari ane mizio yaka tsau kana tsau kana. When your prophet is preaching total separation. God separation from all unbelief. He says, you know, people are different. Some are made of gold. Some are made of brass. He says, but some are made of wood. You see? He says, God has his variety of people. Where do you where do you fit? If you got the seed of God, then you are made of God inside. But if you are full of unbelief, wood. Praise the Lord. So this king had his vessels. And the vessels they were they were used to serve. Eh? Vessels of honor. And vessels of dishonor. And there was royal wine in abundance. According to the bounty of the king. Verse 8. Verse 8. And the drinking was according to the law. None did compel. Praise the Lord. Amen. That uh, you, you have to drink. You would drink whatever you want. You remember Brother Branham when he visited Germany? Uh, the, those people. They are full of wine every time. Vodka and whatever. When they set their tables, they put their brands there. And Brother Branham was saying, now, 
Brother Brandon Makanga wari kuti zvino ka I may be confused here. Some of these things they look like water. Ah, kamwe kangopisa kacho kakangofanana nemvura. I don't want to drink anything like that. Ina ndisina kunwa chipine chipi chakaita sai chocho. Praise the Lord. Mari varumbidzi. And he was carrying his brand. Zvino akanga akatakura mvura yake every time. Ah, aitakura mvura yake ngo vadzose. And they were asking. Zvino vanga vachibvunza manje. Where is that brand made from? Ko kangopisa kenyu aka makaka wanepi. He was saying it's a special brand. <laughs> and he was making sure <laughs> he restrains to water. You don't drink beer because you have been invited to people who are drinking beer. Look at what your prophet is doing. He's carrying his special brand. Praise the Lord. Amen without saying a lot to people. Because what he wanted was to win them. So that he would get into those breakfasts. Yeah, and in the end, testify. Talk to them about, about how the angel came to him. And he says I was not a, a disobedient to the heavenly angel. And in there, some would choose to be baptized. And some would be sarcastic. But in the end, that's the way the prophet was broadcasting the message. For the king I had appointed to all the officers of his house. But they should do according to every man's pleasure. So, but look at this now. As we enter into our real story here. So there is this woman now. Called Vashti. When the king is having this uh, grandeur. This woman is not thinking of supporting the husband. What does she do? Vashti the queen made a feast for the women in the royal house which belonged to, 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 to the king Ahasuerus. But what is happening? Why is she making a feast? When the king has a feast. Why is this woman not supporting the great king when he has a feast? Why is she choosing to go and meet other women? Women are churches. So there is a church that gathers, that gathers women together and begin to have her own feast in an economical council. When the king is having a feast of the church churches, why is she doing like this? Why is she behaving like this? Why is she not having the semblance of respect? Sisters, I really pray and hope that you don't do that. Be one with your husband. Eh? In whatever he's doing. Be the support structure. Chiva i wembiru ino tigira. Hey, not, ah, not to say ah. Uh, Nanyasha. Uh, Nanyasha. Uh, <laughs> Amen. But now sit down, you came up. What do you want to make yourself? Welcome to another zone. Have you ever seen women that would do that? You don't know how to walk them. You don't know how to walk them. You don't know how to walk them. If my wife is saying this about me, what about the many that don't know me? And the way you respect your husband, 
That's what all the other people would do when they would be dealing with him. If you believe to him, and those that are outside will not respect him as well. As you get, in, you get into the house and say, hey, uh, they saw uh, his wife telling him to remove the shoes. A huge man like me to be told, remove your shoes. No ways. Can. <laughs> I want to uh, sense the uh, stench of my shoe. I, I won't remove my shoes. Praise the Lord. Hey. You must you say, know, share no, yeah. it. Yeah. King Asaras has walked through. I'm going to mop off. Not to say, ah, that a foot of yours, do you see what it's doing? Praise the Lord. What about it? Sister, what going to say? And the certain brother was saying, yeah, is the sister hearing what I'm saying here? What's being said here? Praise the Lord. What about it? Are we together then? But she makes a feast. But do you see the reason why God is bringing verse 9? The woman being talked about here is another church system. When God is saying, I'm having a feast, that woman is choosing to have hers. God is saying, let's baptize in the name of Jesus Christ. That woman is just choosing to say, let's baptize in the name of Father. Son, when God is saying, let's have communion in the evening time, that woman is choosing to say, let's have mass in the morning. Do you follow what I'm saying? When God is saying it's an abomination for a woman to put on that which belongs to a man which pertains to a man. Praise the Lord. This woman is saying it's no problem. You can put on slacks. This God is saying spirits don't die. Jezebel. Jezebel was calibrating her fingers. You saw these women of today. They'll be like cats, you know? Are they sick? Brother Branham, when he saw his church being natural. He, he, he says, I, 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 I'm seeing clean women. Here. He says, they are very clean. When you are in your natural beauty, God through his prophet, he says, you are, you are you, 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 you are clean. Huh? If you bleach yourself, you know, to be uh, uh, of a white skin when you're a black person. Brethren, we are always going to be uh, different. I and Sanga will never be the same. I want Mr. White and Mr. Black. That's Mr. White and I'm Mr. Black. Anzuka bleach on it around the Jugo. Praise the Lord. What are you busy? Can I walk up you up at Jugo? If you are given to be of a light complexion. Uh, praise the Lord because of that. If you are of a dark complexion, why are you troubled? 
Some may come to a point of whereby uh, they become uh, complex about their gray hair. A lot of people die say, your hair. And you are saying, my, my head, my head. How come you want to tell me what to do? Because it's not problem. My girlfriend over there doesn't mind about it. She, she, she doesn't mind. <laughs> she has her grandfather. That's all. You know, the old guys are the ones that take that take uh, that, uh, that have got a good care. Huh? Ah. <laughs> Am I the one who made the hair to be grey? I didn't see any. It's not me. Yeah. 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 Then I look and, uh, and try to see whether it removes my Christianity when I have got grey hair. I, I realized that I will become a, even a, a better Christian. So many girls will resent and say, I don't know. I don't know about you who wants to go to your big young. You, you always have problems. You know, the girls will be after you. They will be saying, ah, those ones are grandfathers. Then we are saved. Then we go on. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hmm? But do you see this woman? She's called Queen. But she's not living according to her measure. Have that honor, that sacredness of being the queen to the king. Uh, even your dressing, and you should not be a tatters all over me. You know the mentality we grew up with the, within the seventies. That uh, the Christmas clothes are bought already. They are there in the wardrobe. Uh, when the mother is not there, you go. Uh, so no no but you go bless it so yeah. Because if that mother of yours realizes, <laughs> you will be given a third of it. Uh, I don't like uh, this kind of women uh, when they would want to go to the city. That's the time that they will be so smart. But uh, just get home when they are home. Just <laughs> When you get there, you'll be wondering, uh, am I married to this soldier? I didn't know that I'm married to Chings, Chingaira. Left, right, left, right, left. Mudzimaya and Ashita Zuku for I pop. Uh, oh, yeah. Do your cause. Yeah. Uh, says the woman has to be presentable. She wants to be presentable. Uh, reason yeah. why she must be having more dresses than what you have as a brother. The sisters are saying, are you hearing that? Praise the Lord. 
na problem kana mkazi achichinja kana 3 times per day I don't have a problem if uh, the wife would have a change uh, of clothes 3 times a day Dasangana ne vavava I met with this one Vakambo wa hostel Aba ba kuya nda chinja These ones are coming now so I must change. Change. Those, ones change. Those ones are coming I must change Imagine what it Yeah I'll be saying a heka How to on Have you never been a black not to become a black cow. Well, can I pass it now? If you don't have, then you don't have. But you know, oh, the oh. dress oh. Uh, the dress uh, the dress uh, the dress uh, the wardrobe. Just stayed for years in the wardrobe. No one puts on. Church. you want to come having a sorrowful sight as if the husband doesn't buy you clothes don't you have clothes see that spirit of yourself you have got shoes Every time, because we don't come in. Heavy, that shoes. Uh, just dress well. What am I doing? Church, brother. Hallelujah. 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 Ask these men. How do you feel when your wife dresses? Go and, uh, alright, I'll give that brother. What you got? Great. And the nose of Mushi, Ramushi. Saka brother, we're going to have a great. So, uh, the brother is going away without the great part that he's supposed to feel. What do you think I resist? Uh, are you dressed, sister? Then the sister says, I'm dressed. I'm dressed. Go in there. And the other one, what do you know? I'm not a poor. 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 I'm that's when we would go there having, you know, uh, those kind of uh, sandals. Not here. Dress well. Here. No one will say anything about you. If they say anything about you, come to me and tell me. Then we'll uh, preach uh, the second part of this one. Dress the way you want. Well, as long as it is scriptural. Praise the Lord. But I don't agree uh, with locks uh, upon women. The spirit of Bob Marley. The spirit of Capleton. Uh, the spirit of Ijaman. Jonathan. The spirit that Jonathan ran away from. But you want to bring that. It's only cut. Uh, you know, uh, comb your hair. Yes. Comb your hair. 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 Comb your uh, we never uh, resist the saloon. Uh, we never resented you from going to the saloon. They can give you a better way of taking care of your natural hair. You brothers uh, who are stopping your wives from going to the uh, saloon to have you know, a good uh, way of doing their hair, you just have to hear the gospel. Yes. Ah, 
Fighters on the Seems as if Jesus passed by. The sisters are asking, why were you not giving me the money to go to the saloon? We were waiting for the pastor to preach it like this. But sister, extreme. But when you go there, sister, don't go to the extreme. Trying to impersonate the one next to you. That's the brother Jesus says, uh, you can just use your comb at home. Because you'll be bringing more problems when you go there. Praise the Lord. The king had a feast. And Vashti had her own program. And this thing displeased the king very much. Then it comes to this time. On the seventh day, when the heart of the king was merry with wine, that's the only time that we see him happy here. In the rest, he's, he, he, he has got a lot of wrath. Haman causes him to be wrong. These other people cause him to be wrath. Vashti calls him to be wrath. Vashti even in the homes, you know, you must be able to uh, huh? coexist and talk to one another about issues in a proper way. Uh, you actually know the way that I'm talking now, uh, we we'll end up fighting. Mom, just when you see him, Baba John, that uh, Baba John, one of my some seems he has got rickets like uh, you know, uh, grandmother so and so. What if that uh, you know issue uh, comes back over to you? What did you Then you are stricken by another blow of words. Then <laughs> you become good. You no longer want to talk. <laughs> uh, why is it that you no longer want to talk? <laughs> when you will be saying things that are against my uncle in Wondi. Those things, they just take off, you know, the peace uh, amongst you. The merriness of the king is then taken away. Look at what he's doing. He says, okay, the wife is not here. But let me also try and brag with my own wife. He commands Mehuman. Mehuman. Bizata. Bizata. And Habona. Habona. Bikta. Bikta. Abakta. Abakta. Zita. Zita. And Kakas. Kakas. The seven chamberlains. These are the people who are managing the household of the king. They are noblemen. They are stewards. Who served in the presence of Ahasuerus the king. What is he commanding them? This man wants to brag. Yeah? Praise the Lord. Amen. And what is he saying? To bring Vashti the queen before the king with the royal crown, with the crown royal to show the people and princess her beauty. For she was fair to look on. There was an issue there. Uh, a certain young man. Now the deacons that were there were saying, don't look at the face. When you look for a girl, you must look for character. 
Don't look at all those things, they just pass away. And the young guy is sick. Upon all these men that were saying, don't look at the faces. Have you ever seen them uh, upon their own wives having anyone who's ugly? But they want us to marry the ugly ones. Those are ones in a victor. And Victor say. If there's something that you can change upon a woman, my dress, uh, are there dresses? Uh, the hair. But there are some things you can never change. If they are ugly, they are just ugly for good. So, when you marry, you must die. Really uh, be wise because other things, yes, you can change. Sisters, that's what he was saying. <laughs> so, this woman, she was fair. Eh? Putting on her crown like that. That's where he gave verse 12. Let's read verse 12. But the queen Vashti refused to come at the king's commandment. By his chamberlains. Praise the Lord. Man. You are also the queen. And God, the king, gives you instruction to keep and to follow. But you are denying the bidding of the chamberlains. Praise the Lord. When we stand here and we say, don't do this, don't do this, do you follow it? Or you become like Queen Vashti. And I don't want. I want to do what I want. Unosodazitomboishanda uh, It doesn't work to hear that the wife is already in Mutare without telling her husband. Do you know that it doesn't work? Uh, uh, what about good you, uh, you hear that he's on his way or she's on his way away from Mozambique. A wife is a church. A woman is a church. Is that so? So not as obedient. Meaning to say she is not obedient. So not as submissive. She is not submissive. So not as a car program. Meaning to say they have got their own program. Other than program in Shokoramai. Uh, a city, uh, a program in Shokoramai. Where were you? I was uh, thinking that uh, if I would just go and fellowship over there. The freedom is too much. That's Vashti. What does the church order say? Those that belong here are the ones that uh, show it by their presence the tithing yao, and their tithing the offering yao, and their offering the building fund yao. and their building fund. If you look in the church, you realize half of the church they don't belong here. Ask the one next to you. Are you part of us? Their presence coming to church, they don't come. Brethren, uh, in life you meet challenges. 
Ndino pasta matoko kasaka no mbota nchitaura chitoko. Madzonzoni. You have uh, you know challenges in life. Ma trouble. Uh, troubles. Musu no fwa uno firwa ndo madziko ne rubano garoti. The day you have a funeral, that's when the deacons will sit down and ask one another, was he or she part of us? Certain uh, stubborn questions are asked. Was they paying uh, their time? Why are you asking? We want to know how we are right. we visit are visiting, you know, uh, one of us, or we are just visiting uh, just a mere believer. There's a time you need us. To show off like that. Have that kind of knowledge of you. There is power in numbers. Mune Simba Muwan. The situation you will meet, you know, will just amortize it so quickly. Because we are many. And brother, it's, yeah, it may not be the money that you want from us. But it's our expertise. Uh, see, uh, it's our support. We will will you be able? Continue to be foolish like that. Then we, uh, we, we look at those that do that 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 not the versions that do what they want. We look at them that belong here. But I, character, yeah. That this character <laughs> is <laughs> and it was related to the way was isolated. Uh, you isolated yourself. Uh, you have uh, yeah. alienated yourself away. Your children you don't want them to come here. Your wife, you don't want her to be here. Yourself, you don't want to be here. Not to be what shall we do with you? In that revelation, uh, go, go on with your revelation. But uh, we have got scriptures that lead us. Uh, we don't want to rush to say they belong to us when they don't want. How can you continue to say that again? Uh, if a girl says no, also say, I only want to be here with her. You love me. Uh, seeing that you don't love me, I also don't love you. How can you continuously love someone who doesn't love you? Uh, you know, to be touched your heart by somebody who doesn't uh, love you. Let not your heart be touched by anyone. Yes, us as a church. We don't want to be attached by somebody who doesn't like us. Maybe they've got better ideas. That's the freedom given to every believer. To look for a church they want and a wife they want. So we give you that allowance. But uh, when you take your allowance, then stand with it. For things to be well. Praise the Lord. There is nothing without an implication. Everything that you do comes back to you. Every decision that you make, you are its beneficiary. You know, And you say, So this is what Vashti does. 
So I want to stop there. But you know, I want to go gradually with this woman. In a very good mood, in a very good spirit. Because I said, well, Sister, why is it that we don't uh, see you? Uh, next door, there's a church. Uh, you know, next door, there's a church. Yeah, a message, message. S- seems like a message. Seems oh. like a message. Okay. Just go there and be part of that. Because tomorrow you will need us. Tomorrow something will happen. Rolling Stone. It's like a rolling stone. Today a person is in Eastern. Park. The other day, Merrick Park. Belvedere. Belvedere. When a person dies, people will ask, uh, uh, where does this one belong to? Uh, they, uh, they, we, we thought uh, maybe it left our church. Uh, Let us ask those ones. Ask them, what are you uh, are you after here? We, we don't all know, know him also. <laughs> you find yourself being disowned here on earth. Are you being received then? Okay. You're forsaking the order of the word. Then you say, Pastor Chitinde, Pastor Chitinde, may you help this guy through. When he, uh, he or she has died in that station of yours, we were thinking that he was going uh, to take him up because uh, he spent many days with you there. Uh, who wants uh, uh, to take care of your funeral? To have a burden of a funeral. Who wants it? Do you hear what we are saying, brethren? Praise the Lord. And if one is my wife, let her behave like my wife. Yes. She not behave. That's all. But if she is not, then she is not. Us? God manager it owns brother. Panish and don't have to put out the sister of some singer Z. Is what I want to tell you. Sharp on the push a man to get up a corner. It's pushing Kazi are submissive. That a wife is not a submissive wife. Burume Gafare na yam Katwa. Let the husband not tend the Maria Pana Zimas and I want to go to Kazakan. Oh, for his wife to say, I thank God there was nothing better that I could get. No Katwa is a tender man, no Murumi one. And the wife also thanking the Lord because of her husband. Vashti. Vashti. So I want to close it there. Sakanada of a rape. So that when I come, then we look at the cancellous effects. Tona. Because they've got words that they say. Said, oh, king, if you leave it like this, then all of us, we have been belittled. There is no home that is going to stand. Praise the Lord. Do you love the Lord tonight? I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about churches. God's provided place of worship. But another one is going to the Catholic. The other one, i When God is saying, I'm going to place my name at a certain place, people, they don't want, they don't want to gather around there and offer their offering. What is the offering that you bring to church? Your singing. Your presence. Eh? Everything that you do is the offering that you are giving in that provided place of worship. 
Then God shows it that here is the place in Jesus. Then somebody says, I go to the Catholic. We are going to see it. The Bible says, and the king was it makes God to be wrong. Then that wife was divorced. By Papa. From that time, and, go, and, and uh, the king married another one. Praise the Lord. The Lord is wonderful tonight. I was really getting into the matter. But I must just close. Do we love the Lord tonight? So when we build like this, then we will describe this Roman system. Then you see the Roman system. Then you see God is very wrath because He's still very wrath. Praise the Lord. Do we love the Lord tonight? Amen. Amen. Let's stand and come close. Let's, Let's close our eyes. Let's close our eyes. Let's close our eyes. Chimere <laughs> Arukuita mwe mtambo, iko kuine mtambo, pa, pa mzinda washe. Tibetere baba, kutipuanise kufokasa pa shokorenyo, kutuurongwa ni hota, unenga uchuronga, dozo atitenge tichiziza, aisho wangu kupakwa muri. Chitibetere ae mwarima karurama, rambaya mjizarura mesedu, mkuzururu wakwe shoko, tatiziza shakawanda mate kwa nano, mwarimchene, uwe ticharamba tichiziza shakawanda, Nekuti imi ndi muno shunu za mesuedu. Taona kuwanda kwa kwewe. Nishimuzuro kwa zofashiti. Tukuona kuwanda kwa kwewe Roman Catholic. Uchipai mwe tziziso. Kupure ya kapuwa na ishe Jesu Christo. Tukukuramba made kwa nano. Nekuti tinemuru meumwe chete. Anova ngimishe Jesu Christo. Ndiyo yumuenga wa maka tenga. Wa maka wendra pa Calvary. Ndiyo ane kuansa kuona ane meso kuona. Shiriku zururu wa made kwa nano. Shitibe serai baba. Nekutita simbisi wa made kwa nano. Taona matimba. E Roman Catholic. Taona matimba e chikara. Tavane uchenjere urinani. Takuwa procha. Zonu zonu pa shokorenyo. Shitipaya kutikama baba. Kutitirambe tichitera shokorenyo. Mwaru wangu taku kuda mkatimemba ino. Shititunga minira e Jehova. Sekutu unza kwa maita. Tinokutenda made kwa nano. Tinimuru <laughs> Tenda ya maruwa masimbaose, taku chipa mbiri, taku chipa kurumbizo kwa muri, potenda kuzimba, chienda inesu baba, mutitunga miriri, fefa enyu, ikoramba elipatiri baba, kuzita ratenzi cheso kristu. Amen. Again on Friday, by the grace of God. Thank you for making it to church. God is good.
is so wonderful. May he keep you in your homes. Uh, in your agreement with, with your families. Continue to move on. God bless you. Shalom. Let your living waters flow over my soul. Let your Holy Spirit come and take control. Every situation that is trying. My pride.